Welcome back to HodgePodge. There are many ways to edit your viewports and navigate your viewports in Rhino 3D. This tutorial will cover all the very basics. Begin by opening up your camera 3DM file in Rhino, or any file really. To change the size of each viewport, you may click and drag each viewport shared edge. If you have zoomed out in one window, to automatically scale the view of the remaining viewports, you could right click on your viewport title, select Set Camera, and Synchronize Views. The remaining viewports will zoom to the same degree. If you would like to zoom into a specific portion of your model, you could do so by selecting View, Zoom, Zoom Window, then click and drag to define your zoom window. To zoom to a specific object, first select the object you would like to zoom to, then go to the top menu and select View, Zoom, Zoom Selected. To maximize a viewport, you have a few options. You could do so by right clicking on the viewport title, or you could do so by selecting the following icons above your viewports. Using this option, the viewport that is currently selected will be maximized. The third way would be to go to the top menu and select View, Viewport Layout, Maximize Viewport. This will apply to many, if not all, actions we perform in Rhino 3D. There will always be several different ways of performing the same action. Thank you for watching. I promise these videos will become a little more interesting as we advance. This has been a presentation of the second Rhino 3D exercise in the Level 1 Training Manual. Please click the following links to view the next and previous tutorials in this series, Drawing Lines, and The Basics. As always, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe.